Greetings and welcome to the Computer Studies Podcast. I'm your host, Mr. Stephen Elliott, and I have with me my third favorite student, Dan Rowe. Thanks for joining us again. We're doing some more Halo, uh, just some map walkthroughs again. So uh, join us. We're going to look at Hang 'em High first, another classic map. Though Dan and I were both talking before this, and we agreed we don't like this map. So, nope. Uh, it'll probably come up in rotations occasionally, and you will die constantly. It's it's a very open map that still indoors. Lots of lots of mayhem. So yes. let's go ahead and take a look at it. I'm standing at the top of one of the towers in one of the corners. Uh, Dan standing over in the other corner there. Hello. And as you can notice, this is a very open map with a lot of walkways, a lot of different places that you can go, right? Uh, but there is there is some logic to the nonsense. There is. Okay? Both sides have a little shotgun bunker, as I like to call it. Nice little area where the shotgun spawns. There's the one on my side. There's the one on Dan's side. Then there's all the tombstones. Again... Don't know who thought this was a good idea, but they make great <laughs> cover. Uh, they make it very hard to run in straight lines. So if you find yourself down in those open areas, uh, as long as your opponent is on the same level as you, you've got some good cover. But as yep. soon as you've got an opponent like myself who's elevated, I, of course, can see right down in between those things. They don't offer a lot of cover. All right. uh, you'll notice these walkways. Let me go ahead and I'm going to walk down yeah, these gotcha. walkways a little bit towards this overshield. So we've got some walkways on this level. This is kind of the top level. Dan's over there on the walkway. You can see me on the walkway. Um, and then there's a lower walkway, which let me drop down on there. There it is. Okay. Each of these walkways go to different places. Uh, fairly confusing. There's some ramps to get up on them. You can kind of get up from the bases on either side. Uh, lots of places to go. Lots of different paths. Crazy. Uh, underneath where Dan's standing, you can see on my screen, there is a uh, covered room as well as some hidden tunnels back there. So Dan's going to go ahead and run down this from is, the top. Remember it's oh, yeah. And there, well, so, yeah, go down that one. So there's the ramp, or rather the pathway along the wall. There he is in the room. And if he keeps going, I didn't he's know gonna, this existed. Really? Yeah. Oh, dude. That Every is the, time I'm running around, just trying not to die. <laughs> that is the best place to go with a pistol. This is wonderful. Just plink everybody because you're so well concealed. And no one even thinks because they're just constantly getting hit by people on the. Oh, oh, that's beautiful. May or may not be the place that I camp. So, yes. Okay. And nice then you've got hallway. your nice long hallway, and I'm coming from the other end. There we go. Hi there, there. Dan. So that goes out to the uh, walkway at the middle level. There's a little ramp over here. There's the active camo. Rocket launchers there. Sniper rifle, pretty much impossible to get to unless you are really good at platforming because it's sitting. Let me see if I can get to a place where I can see it real quick. Here, I'm at a place where I can see it. Okay, yeah. So basically, you get up on the top walkway. And you have to and jump. And you have to jump onto this little guy. Across, which is not an easy task. Yep. Okay, this also, walkway here is the shortest way to get between the bases, but it's also the most... Uh, unprotected so kind of a risky move there but many a flag have traversed that walkway unscathed so because otherwise people just don't know how to get back <laughs> yeah so, okay, let's be I honest lost. i don't know where i'm going it's the only option it takes too long to get home so all right uh, uh health right in the middle of the map down in the trench there if you need some more health there's one down there there's as also well as in a the bunker in the bunker so mm -hmm. uh, kind of nice uh, grenades and such all around the map the nice two placements. Yep. The two towers. You'll notice there is the uh, the flag is on that tower and this tower. So yep. If you're so trying to get flags, from flag flags to flag, either side, and you'll notice the blue symbol and the red symbol for blue base versus red base. Awesome. So. All right. Cool. Well, that's hang 'em high again. We're trying to keep this short. So let's see what else we have. All right. Close. So chill out. Another map that uh, is good for small groups. It's another indoor map, but it's a lot more constricted. Okay, uh, let me move to the, what I call the main room. Dan's already there. So we've got our main room here, and you'll notice right away we've got a room with a teleporter in it. We've got a broken bridge. We've got a hallway that goes off to the side. And on the other side of this ramp here, we've got another room. Lots of different places you can go here. Let's see if we can put some logic to this. I'm going to go ahead and walk into the room with the teleporter. 
and hey, there's the pieces of the broken bridge. I had never put together that that's what those were. Are you serious? I just thought those were chunks of metal sitting on the ground. Those are the parts of the broken bridge. Wow, learn wow. something new every day. The more you know. Walking down this hallway, you'll notice I've got a nice little room here, another teleporter, and that takes me back into the main room. Same thing, this little side room here, I've got a nice little ramp down. This one, I have no clue what's going on here. We've got floating boxes of stone. I, you know, I'm not sure what's going on, but uh, got that room. Again, go underneath the little bridge, walk around. Hey, we're back into the broken bridge room. So we've got Hello. a nice little uh, figure eight, I guess, or central room with two little side side rooms. Mm -hmm. I don't know how you want to describe that. but uh, So, so where do the teleporters take us? That's the main level. Well, why don't you go to the teleporter in the room off to your... Uh, left there. I am lost. Yep, go behind you. Behind me? Yep. Thank you. That way, that way. Okay. So teleporter number one in the broken bridge room. This actually takes me up to a room that's on one side of the broken bridge. And Dan, if you go into the other teleporter, it puts you on the other side of the bridge. So the teleporters essentially take you up to the tops of the bridges, but one of them puts you in this little room here. The other one puts you over there. Dan, do you think you can make that jump? Of course. Good question job. is the other way. Can you make it? I don't think you can. Oh no! I <laughs> thought I had it. I thought I had it. Okay. So you'll notice there's a little bit of an elevation change. So going one way down the ramp is actually easy. The other side is pretty hard. So, all right. So in this room here, which is where the active camo is and the sniper rifle. Oh my goodness! There's a third teleporter. I'll show you where that goes in just a minute. This goes to the top of the ramp in the other room. Oh, there's the rocket launcher. Okay, so then if I go down my ramp, down my ramp, I'm gonna go back into what I call the shotgun room because there's a shotgun right there. Got my shotgun. If I go up a ramp to the broken bridge, across the broken bridge, and I'm back in my uh, active camo room, and back into the room with the teleporter. If I go in the teleporter, I show up in the shotgun room. So that's essentially an across map teleporter. Which is uh, nice. Which is pretty nice if you're trying to get across the map. Okay. So yeah, kind of cool. Where is this? Where am I? Uh you know, I'd never actually put it together, but keep looking there. Yep. You are right above me. Oh cool. I just thought that was a window into a random room. So Cool. Anything else? I think that's it. I saw so the uh, flamethrower. Oh, that's yeah, where the rocket launcher there's is. There's a rocket launcher up there. There's a flamethrower in, in the, the broken main room. bridge room. Mm -hmm. um, I don't think there's a fuel rod gun. The sniper rifle is up over there. Maybe there is a fuel rod gun. I just don't know where it is. Okay. But pistols right in that main room. It's my favorite weapon. Go for them. This map's pretty good with the shotgun, Woo! though. So. Yes, All it right. Is. Very cool. Let's see if we can get one more map in real quick. Uh, boarding action. Yes. Boarding action is very confusing the first time you play it, but after you figure out what's going on, it's, it's actually really, simple. really nice. Essentially, boarding action is just two sides that are identical with nothing in between them. And that'll make a little bit more sense when you Slayer. see it. Slayer. Sniper rifles. That's Sniper all rifles you need. All about this map. You get the oh, sniper rifle and you're launcher. fine. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and Ooh, work my way. Are you already on five? I'm already on five. Okay, well, Dan, why don't you go ahead and peek out across the way. So I can see here he's here on level four. So as you look around, you'll notice you have level one, level two, level three, level four, level five. And as you see Professor Elliot across the way, he is uh, just moving up, using the stairs to go up and down. Let's make it to level five. And so since Dan is kind of looking at me, I'm going to flip on you real quick. Yep. And now I'm looking at the red levels. You'll notice the red level numbers. There's one, two, three, four, and five. So mirror images on both sides. You'll notice the teleporters. The teleporters take you exactly there, but on the other side. So if Dan were to go to one of his teleporters. Uh, bummer. So Here we go. I'll choose the other one. Actually, I can't get over there. <laughs> Can you get over? Oh, you can't get over to the other one. There's nope. a wall there. Never mind. Okay. So if I go through uh, here? So let, yeah, you go through that Yay. one, and then I'll go through this one, and there we go. We've switched sides. Woohoo. 
right? Um, so teleporters just take you directly across the map to the other side. There's teleporters on level one and teleporters on level five. There's a couple of nice little rooms, lots mm -hmm. of ladders to get in between things. Very but be open. careful because there is nothing between the two sides. And so you can't jump across. Even nope. if I'm I am way up here on level five, if I walk over towards the side here, I'm not going to make it. Stars. So, and then you lose a point. So, yep. Uh, so that's boarding action. Fairly simple. Uh, really difficult to navigate. The, uh, the goal with this one is really just kind of try and get up towards the top. Uh, Abram Hurlburt would disagree with that. Do you know he's a level one guy? Do you know why he's a level one guy? Because no one looks down there? Because everybody who's looking down there is a headshot. Because they're peeking over the edge. Uh -huh. So he just sees heads. So he likes his level one. I'm more of a level five guy so that I can see more of what's going on across the map. You like more kills. I, I like to be able to see what's going on a little bit better. Yep. So, but anyway, that's boarding action. Fun one for snipers. We'll do snipers on that one. It's a nice little shooting gallery. Uh, but believe it or not, the pistol is one of the better weapons across the map. So, not bad. Cool. Thank you very much for joining me. That was like three maps in one video. Not bad. Cool. We'll see you guys next time. Bye. Let me get up to the top and then I'm going to intro the video. Do you want me to go to the opposite top? Yeah. I'll let you do all my stuff. I'll, oh, I'll let no. you do Ouch. Did it you really just do that? fell all the way down to the bottom. I, I see that. And it's the beep, 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 beep. Uh, <laughs> Let's intro with that. <laughs> this oh, is boy. why we're not supposed to be the only two who are Josh, here. Josh, <laughs> we need you. Oh. Oh. Oh, there we go. Okay.